Hello my students, 4th grade, how are you today? Welcome again in Aladdin Muhammad schools. This lesson is lesson 4, which is a grammar, and you need to open your people's book page 101. And we have an outcome for today. Use will, want, for future predictions. Predictions. My students, please open your uh, pupil's book, page 101. Look and read. Look and read. Look at these pictures in this blue box. What can you see in the first picture? Yes, excellent. We can see this mother with her daughter. What are they doing? What are they doing? Yes, they are watering a plant. And she said about this plant, it will grow. It will grow. So, فتنمو توقعت بعد أن قاموا بسق هذه النبتة أن تنمو. Now look at the next picture. What's happened for this plant? Yes, it want to grow because as you can see here this plant doesn't have water or worms to grow so we use will or want for future predictions نقوم باستخدام will want للتحدث عن التوقعات المستقبلية so this double L means well, well, and this one, this is the, F, the negative form from well, which is want. So, dear students, let us see this graphic. Will or won't for future predictions. <laughs> it will grow. It'll grow. It will not grow. It won't grow. It'll grow. It won't grow. Now please move to the second activity, look and complete. As you can see here, my students, we have two pictures. The first picture is about a plant and the second picture, we can see three baby birds. So, in this, in this activity, we have to use will or want to talk about predictions for these two pictures. Now, let's complete the first sentence. It, and we have a space, need water and light. تحتاج الماء وضوء من الشمس excellent which is the first picture and here we have to use will it'll need water and light هي سوف تحتاج الماء والضوء so the, the first five sentences is about the plant we have to answer them about the plant and from 6 to 10, we have to answer them about the baby birds.
Now let's move to the second one. It have leaves. Excellent here. We have to use well. It will have leaves. And the abbreviation form uh, from well is double L. It will have leaves. Number three, it make a noise. Look at this picture. Will it uh, make a noise? No, it won't make a noise. So here we have to use won't about the sit land. It won't make a noise. Number four, it grow into a plant. Excellent. So here we have to use will. It will grow into a plant. So far, So here we have to use will. Number five, it grows scales. Will it grow scales? هل سوف يكون لها قشور? No, so here we have to use want. It won't grow scales. Number six, which is about these baby birds, they learn to swim. No, they won't learn to swim. Here we have to use want. They won't learn to swim. Number seven, they leave the nest. Yes, they will leave the nest. So for your ready rulosh. Number eight, they change into butterflies. So for your tahawalu ila farasha. No, they won't change into butterflies. So here we have to use the negative form, which is want. Number nine, they grow feathers. So for your mula reish. Excellent. Well, and the last one, number 10, they learn to fly. Excellent. So here we have to use well. They will learn to fly. So for the My students now move to the next activity. Discuss with a friend what will or won't you do tomorrow what will or won't you do tomorrow ما الشيء الذي سوف تقوم بفعله والذي لن تقوم بفعله غدا now look at this dialogue between these two boys the first boy said I'll walk to school tomorrow I'll hear this boy used well I'll walk to school tomorrow. So for Amshil and Madrasa. And the next boy said, We won't have PE tomorrow. Here also he used want. Want. My students, now you have to discuss with your friend or with your family about things that you will do or won't do. For tomorrow. My students, don't forget to send me your discussions. That's all for today. Thank you very much and see you next class. Goodbye.